Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today I'm doing another product review on the ZTE Z222 cell phone. So this is the box that it comes in. Really green and colorful. And the ZTE Z222 phone features are a VGA camera, a mobile email and messaging, mobile web, download capable, and stereo Bluetooth 2.0 capable. In the box, it has a phone, a travel charger, Li-ion battery, and user guide. So that's the sides, front, open side, back. So let's jump right in. Open the box. This is what the phone looks like. Okay. It's like a almost like a navy blue. Okay. And you open it. So it looks like opened. And then closed. And then you open this. You have the charger. So this clip is just showing me opening up the charger and explaining that the employee that sold the phone had already turned on the phone and had already charged it up a bit. So that's why, you know, it didn't have the tie or nothing that it was already unraveled. Okay. So here's the charger. And it's it's pretty long. I would say it's more than three meters for sure. And it is a micro USB. And I have your user guide. So in this clip, I'm just showing the user guide. It comes in English and Spanish. You flip it to the back for Spanish and the front for English. Feel free to go ahead and pause the video and read the user guides and look at the pictures if you feel like it but that's pretty much all i'm saying here i'm going to just speed it up a little bit more yes i am doing a voiceover after i filmed because i had actually gone into depth but i mean you guys can just pause and read it yourselves so if not this whole video will be much longer than it really needs to be Now let's turn this bad boy on. So press and hold here. So first I want to apologize for all the voiceovers. I'm currently editing the video, so I'm doing this while I'm editing. But the one thing that I have to say, honestly, that I do not like about this phone is the amount of time it takes to power off the actual phone. But that is what it's like to type. Look like that. Okay. So it's pretty cool. I need to look at the option of doing this. Okay. Now, I should say a disclaimer because it doesn't come with a disclaimer in the packet but if you don't live in the United States Canada 
or South America. So I live in Bermuda. In Bermuda, you, we do not have the option of having the following. Sending pictures through multimedia. Now this is a postpaid phone and does not work. So sending pictures through messages does not work. Okay, browser does not work. Games and apps do not have the application. Okay. It's for the camera quality. I mean, you know, for a flip phone. Camera wise, I think pretty good. Photo quality, brightness, contrast, effect, shutter sound, video camera, my pictures. So you have a lot of options for a flip phone. Some of the shutter options are some one. Does not like a camera? Oh, this if I'm shaking, it's because where the tripod is located. It doesn't let me be right behind it. So I'm doing this from the side. That's shutter two. And sound two. Pretty good phone, not much to talk about, you know, some of the settings do include some personalization, so you choose your profiles, general meeting, outdoor, silent, or flight, which is actually pretty good because it's rare that you see flight mode on a flip phone. Okay, and on the phone, it's your language. So in this next clip, it's pretty much self-explanatory what I'm doing. I'm just showing you the different types of wallpapers that come with the phone. Feel free to pause the video on each picture if you would like a closer look. You get a decent choice. And of course, you can choose from the pictures. You can manage themes. So you have default. We have green, which is bright. Okay. Like I said, I did buy this with my own money. And I actually bought this for my dad. Well, I said I chose the phone and he paid for it. But like it's a it's a pretty good phone. So you have a keyboard light, you have you can put the owner's name on it and put a greeting. Now, the thing with this phone, for kids born in this century, is we have here, I think it's called, it's not a T9, 
But this is how we used to type. Okay, so to get to C, you will need to press two, three times. So, let me write, hello YouTube. So for YouTube, you'd have to press 9 3 times, 6 3 times, 8 2 times, wait for it to move the next character, press 8 again, wait for the next character, press 8 twice again, press 2 2 times, and press 3 2 times. Okay. It's a, it's a pretty good phone. I like it. It's loud. It's cute. Okay, so I promise this is the last voiceover of this video. But give this video a thumbs up if you are a 90s child and you remember flipping your phone shut whenever you were angry with someone and you want to hang up the phone in their and face. The buttons are up and down. And in here is where you would plug in your charger. Or the headphones. So yeah. So user guide, phone, charger, box. So thank you for watching and I know it's pretty long but that is a thorough product review because usually when I'm looking to buy a phone or anything and I look for product reviews they're like six minutes and they get to the point they don't go in depth so I hope you guys like give me a like and subscribe if you like this video and if you have any questions just leave them in the comments below and I'll be sure to answer thank you bye bye